Hey, welcome back to Commercial Finance Experts Academy. My name is Sua Trung. And today I want to talk with you about the mindset of, of, of financing, the mindset of doing business, starting out. Now, when I first started out, did I start out at a low level? Meaning, did I tell all my clients, I am the cheapest commercial financing guy you can find. I'll start out with half percent. Matter of fact, I'll go work as low as a quarter percent on everything, same with other deals, right? I need deals. That's a scarcity mindset. Now, it, it, it's not bad, it's that we all start out that way. The problem with that is this, when a client comes to you and say, I, I, I want a break, where do you go from a quarter percentage point? Like, like how much more discount can you get? Like, zero? <laughs> like, I'm not gonna work for 10, 10, 10, 10 cents on a dollar. That's just nuts. How do you stay in business in the long run, right? So let's look at it differently. Actually, let, let's go back to that on, on the same scarcity mindset. Now, I'm a commercial financing guy. I sell the workshop, almost $5,000. I could have started out saying for $199, I'll teach you everything about commercial financing over the weekend or over, over four months long. How do you feel about that? What kind of value do you feel when I tell you? As a matter of fact, you can put payment plans in place and pay me hundred dollars, actually no, even fifty dollars a month for the next four months. It's a two hundred dollar course. First of all, you probably think in your head, like, oh shit, this guy probably gonna take me garbage. It's probably will be no value to me. It's probably gonna be stuff that I can probably Google. So what's the point, right? So you're starting out a, a, a relationship like that at the beginning already of of very low value and your, your mind is already if you have the client the clients are looking at you as as, as it's like this guy probably is definitely somewhere he's like he's not a high respectable guy he doesn't probably know a lot he's just fishing for extra money and maybe this is part-time gig so the impression that you get of you are you reputable? Uh, are you held up to a higher standard? Are you knowledgeable? Uh, are you experienced? How confident is this person? All of that is pushed down to, on a scale of one to 10, you pour down to one or two. Does that make sense? So let's look at them on, on the other side, right? When I started this program, literally started live, I said, no, the program's gonna be $5,000. I believe it's worth a lot more than that. As a matter of fact, I'll probably double it in the near future here. And the why is this? I actually put more effort. Think about this. As, as, a, as an instructor or as a professional, when your demand is higher, demand a higher type of clientele. When you demand a higher type of clientele, what do you mean? I, I, I want to... Uh, Students that come to my workshop, not just starting out as a mortgage broker. I want them to be in a business at least two, three years, their work experience. I want them to, to respect me and to know me in the industry so that when they come to my workshop, they're open, open to listening, not judgmental and not in, in, in a position of doubt, right? And the same thing if you were talking to your clients, if, if you come from a scarcity mindset, you're afraid that's the only client you have, you're afraid of losing that client, they got you. They have you where they want you. And that's not a great position to, to, to start from, right? Usually as a professional, you want to be a position up here, right? But if the client is got you by the boss, excuse my language, you start out position below them. Now you're a matter of a slave to them than a professional to help them. Does that make sense? Here's, here's why I offer my course at $49.97. When you come to my workshop, you're damn gonna listen hard. You're gonna learn something. You better damn make sure you learn something. You're not gonna be snoozing. You're not gonna be nodding off and you will be more active. You'll be more engaged. You ask me all sorts of questions. Everything under the sun you can think of, right? Because why? There's a risk of losing that much money if you don't take anything away to benefit from taking taking the time to spend two days. Think about it, time away from the family, 
time away from your, your play time, the weekend's fun, time away from your friends, doing what? Taking no value, taking nothing added to your uh, arsenal, you're not learning anything new and, and losing $5,000? That's just stupid, right? So, because you know there's so much at stake, you're willing to put so much heart and mind and soul into learning everything you can so that once you're done with Sue's course, you can go out there and make that money and then some. That's the idea. And that's what I do too, because I charge a high, high dollar. I make sure, I make damn sure that my content is not fluff. I make it a point that if you don't get it, I'll help you get it. All right. I want you to learn something. You can make five, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50,000 dollars from spending the 5,000. I don't want to spend the 5,000 and get nothing out of it. Matter of fact, I don't want you to be there. Right? If you're not going to take what I teach and monetize it, don't come. That's not the reason why I create the course. I create the course so that all of us can become the profession that we're more than capable of. Not just in financing, but in the business world. So that way, when we go out into the work, workforce, when we go out into our community, we are seen as that professional. You come to me for my advice, right? Not for me to suck up to you. That's not what you come to hear me for, right? Otherwise, you might as well go online and do your own thing with the rate hub, wherever it is, right? You don't need me. But because you need my service, you need my knowledge, and you need my connections, and everything else that I have in between my two ears, that's where the value is. And that's where you can demand big dollar. You can't start from half percent and go down. However, you can start at 3%. And still end up making two percent or at least minimum one percent right all my clients are now paying me three percent even the one last night i spoke with them and he's done several deals with me already he's done three deals with me already three different financing now i'm charging him more and i ask him are you, are you willing to pay me an extra percentage now my fee's gone up he says sure because i add value and i told him how he can make more money than that I show how on his next project, he can do two projects instead of one at a time. He goes, wow, that means I can make $400,000 instead of two hundred. dollars That's right. So you're okay paying me, pay me $48,000 out of that. It's cost of doing business, right? He said, yeah, I'm okay with that. I'm okay with that too. <laughs> so hopefully you can learn and the takeaway from this is that come to the workshop and take everything in that I teach so that you can go out and make big impact into you know your community and also your income, right? At the end of the day, this is what we're talking about, right? Money talks. Take care, and I'll see you next video. If you like it, please subscribe to my channel. I'll have more uh, in, in down the road. This is the end of the 100 video series. I look forward to seeing you at the workshop, and it's been a grateful ride, a grateful ride for me that uh, you've been here listening to me and just watch me grow over the, over the video number one to video 100. Take care and I do want to see you at the workshop and that then you can make a difference in your family and your community. Have a good one. See you at the top.